Explore three return of spontaneous circulation presentation method with lips. There is several methods to present ROSC in high fidelity simulation. Let's explore and compare ROSC with on the fly programs, teams, and scenario manipulation. Let's make a guess which simulation control approach for each of these patient monitors. Which is your favorite? Which is the most appealing in the high fidelity simulations. Demonstrations on the fly maneuver with lips instructional application. This is an on-the-fly simulation manipulation. You can tell by parameters is changed one after another. The blood pressure dips way after the loss of organized ECG rhythm. It gives a sense of blood pressure disassociated with ECG rhythm. A delay in end tidal CO2 fall failed to connect CO2 excretions with cease of perfusion. The step by step become obvious in state require cascading changes, for instance, ROSC. Post defeat ECG can't respond as swiftly and absent in details of myocardial electrical signals transformation. Organized rhythm wasn't correlated to cardiac output. Erupt circulatory and SPO2 recovery. Erupt ETCO2 recovery. On the fly manipulations is simple in simulation control but challenging in producing a high fidelity parameters progression. Demonstrations of program teams with lip instructor applications. This is the overview of teams controls with three states of baseline, BT, and RSC stage. Tag of baseline is selected. Click the green buttons to activate this state. Team simulation manipulation has characteristics of all commands of a state start at point A and all end at point B. Select VT, click activate to launch this state. The team state VT is activated with all parameter plunged simultaneously. Select RSC, synchronize click of activations upon learners delivers defibrillations. All parameters leap into point B instantly. Team is more an all or none approach. It is simulation executions, but insufficient in mimic physiological parameters oscillation. Demonstrations of program scenario with LIPS instructor applications. This is the control panel of program scenario with three events or states. Unlike teams, there is no preview parameters. Baselines and VT are simple events. RSC hold the cascading commands upon detect defibrillation shock. Baseline is triggered. This is baseline at patient's monitor. Next, trigger VT for state 2. Ventricular tachycardia has been launched successfully.
click RSC, the system will sense for defibrillation shock before present the subsequent sub-state. RSC has been activated, but post-defibrillation commands will only activate upon defibrillation is detected. The noise indicates the virtual defibrillator is being charged for defibrillation. Defibrillation shock is captured and RSC command kicks in in three sub-state. Post defibrillation's flatline, falling heart rate has myocardial regain organized ECG rhythms and flush out of accumulated CO2. Gaining of ECG rhythms with PVC indicates post ischemic myocardial dysfunction. App of CO2 has re established of perfusions and circulatory CO2 fell. SPO2 was reinstalled with improved perfusions and respiratory support. Overview of program RSC. In state 1 and 2 are simple straightforward single layer events. In contrast, the last event holds three substates with synchronized activation. This coordinated manipulation begins with a click on RSC and defibrillation detect by the system. The first substate gives commands of post defib ECG flatline, low parameters to allow subsequent regain process of each parameters. The second substate would be triggered by the asystole of first substate, low range heart rate and BP indicates early recovery and high ETCO2 indicate flush up of metabolic waste accumulated in the state of VT. The last substrate set in with systolic BP above 40 mmHg. It produced normalization in heart rate, BP, SpO2 and F of entitled CO2. Alright, that's all for this video. I hope that it will help your next simulation. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.